Whiskey 2, Juliet, Papa Sierra. Whiskey 2, Juliet, Papa Sierra. Roger, roger. Roger, roger. This is Whiskey 2, Juliet, Papa Sierra. John in Cooperstown, New York. Over. Roger, John. And give me your location again. QBH is Cooperstown, New York. Cooperstown, New York. Over. Roger on Cooperstown, New York. Well, gosh, uh, what radio are you running, sir? I am on an ICOM 76. Radio you're running, sir. I caught the ICOM. Uh, repeat one more time, please. ICOM 7610. Uh, did I copy uh, ICOM 7610? All right, all right. Well, the first thing to do uh, is uh, check your, make sure your uh, compressor is on the three. Set your compressor, engage your compressor at a three. Move to your ALC with mic gain in hand and adjust your ALC to uh, mid scale to two thirds. Mid scale to two thirds by uh, mic uh, level adjustment. Roger. Okay, John. Uh, now, uh, there's one other procedure that we need to do since you're running that 7610. And let me make note of that. 7610. Uh, I want you to look on the left-hand side of your radio to find a button marked to quick. A button marked quick uh, on your left-hand side of your radio. All right. Now, quick will take you to drive. Do you see drive? Okay, and what's the setting on drive? Uh, normally you would have 50% uh, on drive. What, what is it reading now? Roger, uh, it is at 50%. Over. All right, move that to uh, 65. Move that up to 65, Roger. Okay, we are moved up to 65. Over. All right, now that uh, just increased your audio level probably about t 10 to 15 percent. Now what you need to do, and be sure you do, is uh, stay on access to your microphone because that uh, drive will try to keep your, your audio level consistently high. And if you get off access to your microphone, uh, you will lose your highs, but that uh, will continue to try to keep your audio up so you will become, uh, you know, semi-muddy. So you always want to work, uh, stay on access to your microphone. Roger. Okay, on axis is that you don't pull away from your microphone. You know, some people have a tendency to look around the room and everything. You need to concentrate, uh, you know, being on that microphone and staying in front of the microphone uh, and not uh, wandering, you know. Okay, I'm in the process of pulling my uh, mag loop around to uh, south, or, I'm sorry, north, to uh, get a better copy on you. Uh, and we're coming uh, 15, 10, 0 degrees. I should have a better copy on you now. Uh, and th I'm only doing this on receive. Uh, my transmit is, is consistently on the uh, dipole antenna. Roger. All right, now I'm seeing your your audio now. You, you're definitely a 3 dB dynamic range, so your average percent of peak modulation is 80 to 85 percent. Just uh, stay on that microphone, and, and you will notice uh, an increase in your sweet spot on your watt meter. Roger, Roger. But uh, right now, uh, you know, Mother Nature is not uh, helping us either out, out at all. So uh, uh, for the circumstance, you're doing really well. Roger.
I heard uh, something about the headset. Repeat about the headset. Don't worry about what the headset says. The most important reading is your ALC meter. Uh, disregard everything uh, but your ALC meter. And you want your ALC meter to run mid-scale to two-thirds. Roger. Yeah, you don't want to be in the red. You want to be uh, mid-scale to two-thirds. You know, uh, like take a look at uh, the the uh, the uh, reading for that ALC meter. So a lot of ALC meters do not r r uh, move the full uh, distance. You know, they they have a uh, marking for ALC, and uh, from one end uh, is the beginning, and the other end is uh, to the right. All right, so to the right is a hundred percent of of uh, that uh, indication. So you want to be mid scale to two thirds of that uh, ALC reading, Roger. All right, so that's the beginning. Yeah, like I say, the the ideal thing where you want to be is mid scale to two thirds, mid scale to two thirds. You, you don't want to be just at mid scale. You want to be mid scale to two thirds as you speak naturally. The gain, the mic gain, controls the reading of the ALC meter. Mic gain controls the reading of the ALC meter. So that's why I'm saying you want to adjust your mic gain until your ALC meter is running mid-scale to two-thirds. Roger. Uh, you're only about uh, half a dB above my noise level, so bear with me. Uh, uh, repeat that last transmission, please. I'm still not copying you. You're only about a half a dB above my uh, noise level. Let me let me go down to 100 watts so you can see uh, what we're doing here. Uh, I'm down to 100 watts right now. One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. I give you uh, some idea of where what we're talking about. All right, uh, now I'm uh, back to a kW. So, uh, uh, John, uh, the nearest I can tell you, buddy, is just uh, adjust your mic gain, speaking naturally on mic, adjust your mic gain to where your ALC is reading mid-scale to two-thirds. So mid-scale to two-thirds doesn't mean mid-scale. It means you're going past mid-scale towards, towards the right-hand side, but you're not going up into the red. You're going mid-scale to two-thirds. Roger, Roger, John. Well, I, you uh, broke through the clouds there, and I had a good copy on you just at the last uh, 12 to 15 seconds of your last transmission. And so your dynamic range is 3 dB. Your means your average percent of peak modulation is, uh, in your case, probably above 85 uh, percent. Uh, but uh, really sounds sounds good. So I would run it just like that. Your EQ seems to be uh, intact also. So uh, get the uh, Gorilla tape and uh, taper down, Roger. Okay, Roger. That's all. Thank you very much. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we got that drive gain up and we got the mic gain up a little bit. And uh, watching that meter, and it seems like it's doing what it should be doing. And the top is set at three. So that, my friend, thanks again, KT9, Victor Keel and Victor from W2JPS. 73s, my friend, and thank you again for what you do.
Roger, Roger, John. Yes, sounds beautiful, sir. And that was another one pretty much in the clear. So uh, if you want to hear what your uh, station sounds like uh, from when we started to where we ended, uh, if you go to YouTube and do a call letter search for Kilo Charlie 9, Victor Kilo Victor, that will take you to our QSO Vlog page. Now, on that page, you'll be looking for one QSO in particular, and it will be entitled My Group Air Check for 17 20 today's date my group air check for 17 20 and we'll have it up uh, in uh, 48 hours roger roger that but sir we're going to look for that i'd love to hear that so just to uh, repeat my group 17 20 Roger, Roger. The date's the most important thing my group air check it's actually spelled air x uh oh uh, four seventeen twenty my group air check four seventeen twenty roger 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 we will look for that uh thank you again you have a great day we'll say seven threes again kc9 kc roger roger and you have one of the most beautiful radios in the world on that 7610 just a beautiful radio threes to you sir uh, this is KC9 VKV, the QSO Vlog Net. If you've got a radio you want to check out, give me a shout.